Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Tarek Alisa. I'm the director of activities here at Eunice Hanoi. And on behalf of the entire Eunice Hanoi family, I'd like to welcome you all to the 2018 Ami Middle School Asia Honor Band Festival. The young men and women you see up, up here on stage are the best of the best in terms of international schools, and it has been an absolute pleasure and honor for us to host this event. They have impacted our community greatly, and we appreciate that. Um, I want to go over a couple of housekeeping things before we hand it over to the next individual who will be uh, communicating the plan for you t this evening. Number one is AMI prohibits any videotaping of the concert, so please bear that in mind. Also, there will be no photography. We ask that you, there's no photography at the end of the event, at the end of the performance. You'll be able to um, take pictures at that stage. Um, and the final piece is uh, these individuals has, have worked really, really hard. Um, and we would really appreciate it if you made sure, even if you think it's on silent right now, double check and make sure that your, your cell phones, your mobile phones are on silent out of respect for how hard these, these um, students have worked and how hard their, the adults have worked with them. So please honor that. The next person I'd like to introduce is our very own uh, band director. He was instrumental in, um, in getting us to be able to host this event and he will take you forward um, with the plan of the rest of the evening. So, Mr. Luke Delagrana. Uh, good evening, everybody. As uh, Mr. Elisa said, uh, my name is Luke Delagrana, and I'm the band director here at Eunice Hanoi. And we are so happy to have uh, these young musicians on stage with us tonight and I'm so happy that you are here to hear the result of all their hard work. Um, it started I think three days ago and they have uh, been in this theater uh, working so hard and it's the hard work for them uh, hasn't just started here it's been going on for a long time and you'll hear that in their performance. Over the last three days We've also been so lucky to have uh, these students working with an amazing guest conductor. And I think w one thing that shows just how great he is in terms of working with the students is that each day, even as the kids were tired, going through six or more hours of rehearsal in a day, um, their playing became more and more musical. And throughout the whole experience, he still managed to find ways to pull more music out of these young musicians. And it's been really amazing watching that process. So um, without further ado, please enjoy and please welcome our guest conductor to this stage, Mr. John Leonard. Thank you.
an extra round for our percussion. Good work back there.
Wasn't that wonderful? I would like to recognize also, we have the arranger in our midst here, Mr. Scott Rogel. Would you please stand and be recognized? <laughs> Wonderful company. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> and one more point, I would like to recognize our percussion and uh, Mr. Shirk, who is also working very hard with him. Mr. Shirk, can you please stand and be acknowledged in our percussion? Thank you very much. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Keith Montgomery, and I am the executive director of the Association for Music in International Schools. We like to pronounce our acronym AMIS as AMI. If you know one word of French, you know that that means friends, and that is our aim. Uh, we believe that bringing like-minded young people together across cultures and across national borders to create works of beauty, can teach them a lesson that they can't learn in their own schools or in their own homes. I can't begin to tell you the level of hospitality that we have enjoyed here in Hanoi throughout the week. We have students from 16 different schools, and I know to look at this band, it's hard to believe that they were largely strangers on Thursday morning. One of the reasons our band sounds so successful tonight is because they've been so well taken care of this week. And I, I hope you will join me in thanking our host organizers, Tarek Alessa and Luke Delagrana. My gratitude runs so deep. Please join me in welcoming. Speaking of hospitality, we have a number of host families in our audience. If you opened your homes, if you turned down your beds and opened your refrigerators for the young people on the stage, can I ask everybody from our host families to please stand so that we can thank you, host families. The piece that you just heard was an original commission. What a wonderful opportunity for these students to perform the world premiere of a piece composed especially for them with the composer present. Uh, if they don't understand how profound that experience was for them this week, they will at some point in their lives. If you believe, as we do, that music has this sort of power, and you would like to see this sort of thing supported by AMI throughout the world, there's information in your season brochure on how you might become a patron of AMI. You saw that the Brodigan family was uh, mentioned in your program. There were four other contributors to that piece, and I'd like to mention Meg Eidecker, Andrew Melton, Derek Kerr, and Ross Jones for sponsoring that piece for our young people. If you'd like to help us in a more immediate way, we have some players on the stage who are here thanks to the AMI Financial Aid Fund. From time to time, we will have uh, students who qualify for one of our festivals but lack the financial means to attend. If their own school doesn't have a system of financial aid, then AMI can help them. And all of the funds that we have in our financial aid account come from donations from audience members. So as you're departing the hall tonight, I will have colleagues standing at the door with baskets that say AMI Financial Aid Fund. If you feel compelled to contribute at that time, please do so. At the end of the season, if there are funds remaining in that account, we use them to commission original works for our composers. I'd like to recognize the schools from which these students come. I'm going to mention the names of the school. I would like the students who participate from that school to stand, as well as their director in the audience. If you happen to be visiting from that school, feel welcome to stand as a sign of your support. We're going to start the United Arab Emirates with the American Community School of Abu Dhabi, where the directors are Tracy Ramsey and Callie Lund.
from India, the American International School, Chennai, where the director is Jason Kennedy. From Tokyo, the American School in Japan, where the director is Mark Miller. From Seoul, Korea, Chadwick International School, their director is Jordan Schurd. From Shanghai, China, Concordia International School. Their director is David Allen. <laughs> Hong Kong International School and their director, Douglas Jordan. Also from Hong Kong, the International Christian School and their director, David Miller. From Thailand, the International School Bangkok and their directors, Brent Poling and Kentaro Udagawa. From Myanmar, the International School Yangon, where the director is Richard Glascock. From Indonesia, Jakarta Intercultural School, where the directors are Rick Bader and Ignatius Sojadi. From Seoul, Korea, Korea International School. Their director is Michael Shirk. <laughs> Shanghai American School, Pudong Campus, and their director, Ross Jones. Shanghai American School Puchi Campus. Their director is Christy Wanamaker. The Singapore American School and their directors Tracy Craig and Rebecca Waters. Taipei American School and their director, Jennifer Anderson. <laughs> On behalf of AMI, I'd like to thank you once again for having us in your homes and in your school. We look forward to coming back. I would call the maestro back to the stage. Thank you very much. I too would be remiss if I did not thank, first of all, you as parents, directors who've supported these students. When the going gets tough, they say, man, I want to quit band. <laughs> or I don't want to take lessons anymore. You've hung in there. And we have a great, great band here. These students, and I, I've, I've been with the international schools, as you can see, for quite a while, and by far, this is the most well-prepared AMI band that I've been around. The students are so respectful and so on task, these long hours of rehearsal. And my heart just goes out to each and every one of them. 
And my heartiest thanks to you as parents and my colleagues, and particularly Mr. Luke Delagrana, and everyone else who have been recognized here. But I too, from the bottom of my heart, wish to give my thanks and gratitude for you and for you and for making my life a little more worthwhile. So thank you.